Ooh. Let's see what's in the box. Shave it up. Everybody, clean shaver here. <laughs> Sorry, my nose did. My nose itched. Anyway, I have a pretty awesome mail call. Holy cow, this thing's freaking awesome. So, about a week ago or so, a uh, guy by the name of Steve reached out to me through my YouTube channel, and he basically said, "Hey, I have a boatload of soaps that I'm not using. Would you like them?" And I was like, "Well." Let me think about that really quick. Yeah, I'll take them. And uh, I, I'm I'm blown away. I was expecting a few soaps, and uh, not this. Give you a perspective here. Yeah, the box is bigger than my head, and it's full and heavy. This is awesome. So to start it off, what have we got here? We've got some Soap Commander samples. I love Soap Commander. All right, so we've got uh, Respect, their Lime and Patchouli. We've got Love, which is their Rose scent. We've got uh, Confidence, Honey and Musk. I love that one. Uh, Wisdom, also very good, Lavender and Peppermint. And then Vision, which is uh, Peppermint and Cool Water, I believe. Either way, Vision's excellent. I love Vision. Cool. And let's see, we've got... William Newman and Company, 1911. Oh, I've heard about this. 1911 shave soap. Oh, huh. that's awesome. That is awesome. Oh man, that smells so good. I'm not sure how to describe it. Spicy. I, I, I'm not the best with scents, but that stuff smells awesome. I'm excited about that. Razor Rock Z-Pep. Green tobacco. Hmm. A while ago I got a sample of, of Z-Pepino and I wasn't the, the biggest fan of it, but I'm digging this. Oh, how things change, I guess. All right, let's see. QED Essentials. Anise and lavender. Let's give that a sniff. It smells like licorice. Licorice and lavender. That's what it smells like to me. Of course, anise is what licorice smells. Black licorice, I should say. Yep, that smells awesome. I'm gonna like that. And let's see. Ginger's Garden Enigma. I think this one is named Enigma because it's hard to say or hard to tell what it smells like. Whoa. 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 That is complex. Wow. But really cool. I, again, I could not tell you what it smells like to save my life. All I know is it smells awesome. And cool image on the tin. Good job, Irina. Got some more Razor Rock Triple X. Um. If I'm not mistaken, Triple X is supposed to smell like Aqua de Parma, I think. It smells good. I, uh, again, I had another uh, sample of Triple X a while back, and I wasn't a huge fan of it, but I don't know. We'll try it out, and we'll, we'll give it a, a shot here. Okay, what else have we got? Just keep going. Supreme Cream from Jack Black. I think I got a squeeze tube of this a while back. Smells clean. Smells like soap to me. Um, very, very soft cream. You can see that. Very soft. But I can feel it should be very slick. So that'll be good. Thank you, Steve. Ooh, <gasps> diamond. Bear Storm and Diamond. This came out around the beginning of baseball season. So weird. Okay, so this smells like grass. 
dirt. Like, seriously, it, it reminds me of when I, I, I used to work in a greenhouse when I was a kid at a nurse at a nursery, like a, a, a plant nursery. It really reminds me of that. And then you get a little bit of wood. I think there's supposed to be leather in there too. I, and I only know that because I've heard other people describe it. But holy cow, that's really interesting. I think I'm going to like that one. Okay, what else? Oh, another barrister, man. Bay Rum. Everybody knows I love Bay Rum. Ooh, that is straight up Bay Rum, too. That's going to be, oh, that's like a dead ringer for uh, Captain's Choice Bay Rum. That's good. Very good. All right, what do we got? Oh, more Soap Commander. Courage. This is one that I don't have. Oh, man, that's good. What is this? Peppercorn, citrus, and cedar. Oh, man. Oh, I love that. That smells so good. Holy cow, that smells good. Of course, I love I love Soap Commander. The Seabirds are awesome. They make great soap. I'm excited about this. That smells epic. And let's see. <laughs> Mike's Natural Barbershop. So, I'm on a a uh, journey to finish off my current tin back here and I've got that much left not much so great I have a replacement tin now Aha! cool thank you Steve you must have known awesome Ooh, what is this holy pedal pusher fancy sandalwood how is it that I've never heard of this? Pedal pushers fancy. Pedal pusher fancies. Huh. Ooh. And look at this. Look at the size of this thing. It's a huge tin. I mean, that's ginormous. That's an intriguing sandalwood. I'm not. I haven't been a huge fan of sandalwood, but I'll, I'll give it a shot and see how I like it. Let's see, it looks like we got three more. Oh, Beaverwood, right? Two bits. So this is their barbershop scent. Mmm, very good. Very good. A little different than Mike's. I couldn't tell you how. It, s it smells a little bit lighter to me, but awesome. And Beaver Woodwright is excellent soap. I've, I used this in a pass around a little while back um, before it was the final product. And the scent was just a little bit weak for me, but they've, they've strengthened it a little bit. I like that. So it should be a good performing soap. The famous Cella. I've never tried it. But I think I know what it's supposed to be like. And <coughs> yeah. I'm not a maraschino cherry or amaretto smell guy. I I enjoy the taste of amaretto, okay, but whew, man, that's just right in your face. Holy moly! Um, I have a feeling my wife will really like that. She loves the. I have a, a tub of P160 from Razor Rock that she really likes, so she'll probably really like this one. But thank you, and oh, the PS de Resistance. My French sucks. Holy cow. It's tobacco, but it's the... It's the, the jar. Holy moly. Oh, I love tobacco. And my puck is almost dead. Oh, yay. And look at that, it's almost new. Holy cow. Thank you, Steve. Wow, that is awesome. <laughs> Sorry, that's excellent. Thank you so much. Holy cow, I, I, I'm at a loss for words, man. This is amazing. I mean, I, I honestly expected maybe four or five soaps, tops. And let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 soaps. 
I've, I've got enough stuff, man. I think I'm probably going to have to pass some of this stuff on to people that deserve it down the road because this is incredibly kind. Thank you, Steve. Um, I probably will end up passing some of this on to deserving people. Maybe we'll do a giveaway a little in a little while and see uh, see what we can do with it. But anyway, wow, I'm I'm at a loss. Thank you so much, Steve. This is awesome. I appreciate it so much. Um, I, I I really at a loss for words, which is an achievement for me. You made me shut up. Anyway. Thanks for watching everybody. If you're watching this video, it's not a very exciting one. I apologize, but uh, don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Voice Byte. Um, you can find me in all those places. I'll put links to the in the, in the description below. And uh, any of you who've tried these soaps, which one would you pick as your favorite? Which one would st stands out the most to you? Put that down in the comment section. Love to hear from you. Anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Be smooth. We'll see you next time.